add weight to you know how has that you know been for him maybe that you I mean, everybody, we just don't have me and AJ. We have uh, Jordan Pass, course, Dylan Esteline, Michael Jolts, and uh, the, we got the young guys coming in, too. So we all have been just working uh, working together, routes, blocking, so we can all just help the offensive offense in a uh, different way. You didn't have the opportunity to uh, enroll early. Jake Butt did, mm -hmm. obviously, in January. Uh, what have you seen out of him? I'm sure his head's spinning a little bit, but, but maybe what have you been able to see out of seven practices so far? Uh, I mean, just... We went through spring, and that was good. And then uh, it's just having all, all the, the uh, same freshman mistakes that I've had and all other freshmen have. So we've just been trying to help uh, help them get better and better each day. Is that a cool thing, the leadership role right now? I mean, you know, helping other guys? I mean, it's different because I'm I'm like a young dude, but I'm actually like an older dude. <laughs> so so it's uh, I think it's pretty cool I get to help them of what I learned last year from the, the older guys we had and are Mike you, and uh, Brandon. Are you starting to get a sense of maybe, uh, you know, leaving that Michigan legacy where, you know, guys coming behind you all of a sudden start to look at you and say, okay, this is what I have to do to move forward and, you know, get to, you know, another level of Michigan football. Do you get a sense of that starting here in camp now? Um, uh, I could probably, you could say that, but uh, I just... I'm just trying to help as much as I can with the knowledge that I have right now because I don't really have it all. Still learn from the coaches and Coger and the offensive linemen of different techniques that I can do. So what I have, I, I try to give on to those. Having said all that, is there any added pressure on you right now? No, I don't think so. No pressure. I'm just trying to go out there and be the best I can be. How much have you leaned on uh, on Kevin? You know, he obviously played the position here for four years, and you guys don't. I mean, you have a, a few seniors, but they don't necessarily have the experience. Uh, you know, that, that normal tight ends do at, the, at that spot. Uh, Kevin, he he's brought he's brought a lot to the picture because with him, like you said, coming back, helping us, I've learned like different techniques that he had in the blocking game that I didn't have in uh, little little uh, things in a uh, passing game as well. So I'm just learning from him, him as much as I can so I can uh, be a better player and uh, same as with everybody else. What about that learning part? I mean, a lot of people might talk about the mental part of this game. Is it uh, an easy flow of information or are guys getting overloaded? How do, how do you walk that line? I mean, we just try to take it one step at a time. If I make a mistake, we fix it on site so I won't make it again. So it's just, I think it's easy to learn from him.